Los Angeles. Now at four, a horrific crash on Mother's Day involving nine members of a local family. Three of them killed, including children. Good afternoon, I'm Juan Fernandez. And I'm Jasmine Veal in for Susie Sa. An Orange County community is in mourning today as they learn about the tragedy that left three members of an Anaheim family dead and six others injured. It happened on the 10 freeway in Riverside County just yesterday morning when their SUV crashed mm -hmm. while on the way to a Mother's Day celebration. KCAL News reporter Michelle Geely has reaction as the community bans to lend support to the survivors. <laughs> Heartbreak for an Anaheim grandfather who lost his daughter Cecilia Villalobos and two grandchildren, 12 and 8 year old Maria and Lexi de la Riva, in a rollover crash on Mother's Day. El niño está en coma. Paco Villalobos explained that two of his other granddaughters, who are 10 and 3 years old, are in a coma. His 15 year old grandson, who is a student at Anaheim High School, has a broken arm. The family lived together here for many years in this apartment on Bush Street. Officials say the De La Rivas were in their red suburban headed to Indio to celebrate the holiday with relatives when on the 10 freeway just outside of Palm Springs, their car and another one collided, which sent the SUV into the center divider. It was just so shocking. Um, three of our community members are gone in the accident, and it's just so f sad, and we're all here united and it's kids from our school and I don't know how I'm going to tell my daughter. Four of the children in the accident went to school close by. In a statement this afternoon, educators said, quote, we are deeply saddened by this terrible news and our entire Anaheim Elementary School District community mourns with the family. Additional administration staff and counselors have been made available to our AESD family to try and find some comfort surrounding this tragic loss. They're good people. Um, their kids were always inside. They never like made any trouble with anybody. Grandpa really took care of them. Really good. Paco Villalobos lost his wife a few years ago. As he pointed to the sky, he said she and three other family members now will be together. According to the CHP, six of the nine people inside of the suburban were ejected, including the two girls who were killed. Officers say not everyone inside of that car was wearing a seatbelt. An online fundraiser has been set up, and neighbors say they're planning another one. In Anaheim, Michelle Geely, KCAL News. And we've just learned there will be a rosary planned.